YouTubers, it's your boy Domination. I'm back again, 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 again. I want a brand new season of the world. Always brand new season. There's no other place in the world. There's no other place in the world. Only place you get. Only place you get is right back to the motherfucking basics. And I'm your own uh, domination. And I'm gonna be the see how you do it. I keep it busy. You know how that goes. I know y'all miss me. I know y'all do. Cause that's how the truck produces that I'm a man out in Dallas, you know that go. Shout out my city, man. But I wanna talk about what's really going on, man. You know, even though we talk about issues, struts of pain, but but this one I wanna talk about is real serious, man. Without no excuse the language, but without no cusses at all. And I'm gonna say something that's real deep. Real deep. It's talking about manhood. What takes to be a man? Mm, that's a lot of things. That's a lot of things what being a man is about. A man is is a be strong, companion, photoship, you know, provider, protector, and damn good lover, you know, excuse me, good lover is as I perhaps. But, you know what I'm saying, it's a lot of reason. Affectionate and, uh, you know, we show emotions and men's if you're not a man, I'm talking about, don't be ashamed, man. A lot of us, like good boys and bad boys, whatever. All men, we show affection. One another, we show affection. How how we feel. And it's, it's just, we show, we just show the toughness. That's hard for us to spread. We don't do like more than women. More women do more than us. We can't do it like women does. We only do it when we, when we feel like, you know, we gotta be tough. We gotta be tough about it, so. But like I said, man, it's a lot of reasons what being a man is really about, man. It's like it was when my mom and dad was was back in those days. You know, when it takes to be a man, real man raise his family, real man take care of his business and kids. That's back in the day. <sighs> right now, let me tell you. I think it's women run the lead right now. And I and I I, I don't mean to say this, but this is true. You look what's really going on. You know what I'm saying? We need to take charge, man. We need to take charge back. And it doesn't matter who's the fighter or not. We need to, you know, go out there and handle our business and really represent what a man should be. You know what I'm saying? Instead of us, because we too damn scared and all that, because we always, we got to be per months ourselves and per months anyone. Because we're afraid of being talked about. Because what, you know, they think that if you is a, is a successful man and this and that and you try to buy your family, somehow they think you're a punk. They think some reason, that's what these men, these young men think nowadays. And that's why you, you see men right here, right now, have a hard time to, you know, what a, what a manhood is. Because you got a lot of, you know, dudes did not grow up without a father. They ain't trying to teach them how to be a man. Ain't trying to teach them. I know I had a father. My father was there, but it ne he never showed me what a man really is. Only thing I got it from my uncles and them. I mean, he, you know, he, you know, never put a clothes on our back, but kind of, he never showed me brush my teeth or nothing like that. I mean, it's my uncles. I only got it from my uncles and them. That's who I was really close by. We didn't have a really good relationship that much, but like all oh, fuck, I just think the problem is when because we so strong and so demanded, like we think, uh, oh, you know, we don't need anyone. That's that's how we feel like that. We feel like we don't need nobody. But the truth is, man, we speaking, man, we do need folks. Cause a lot of us, time, man, if you look at man's art today, a lot of them are dead, incarcerated. Think one of the two. They they in more prison than they ever go to the college. And the, and another problem is college costs too much money just to go because some people can't even afford to go to college. Some people just can't afford to just go to college. I mean things are getting pretty rough there right now, but it will get better, man. It's going to take a m much a while. It, it will get better. I mean, you got a lot of people just losing their mind, dog. Like, it's no, it make any sense, man. Like, nothing. 
and we can't, and you know, we can't even be the kind of men to, 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 for the children, to the children, to the, or women. We can't even do that because, you know, we gotta let women take over everything, which is nothing wrong with that, but we need to take that, that, that charge back. We need to get that back. But, pro, but the sad part, we will never be. Because a lot of us like that, we feel like we, we feel unhelpless. We gotta feel like we gotta fight in our battles, man. And the sad part, you would tell people once or twice, nobody gonna listen. That's like talking empty walls, man. No one wanna wanna listen. Because we grew up in the ignorance and we see things that a lot of us, you know, we pick up on just like that and thinking like, whoa, you know, and trust me, I know. Sometimes I always feel like I could do everything for myself. But I always feel like I don't need nobody. But if you look at my face, sad part, I do need somebody. I, I do need some of a, a woman though that really, you know, you know, supported me and lift me up. You know what I'm saying? And it's hard to get that sometimes because you got a lot of that men and women out here right now, you know, being betrayed at each other. And that's why a lot of us out there. I have a hard time what being a man is. Being a man is to me is being responsible. Always hold your own and be your own. And and people to treat it how you want to be treated. Don't you could be quite a critical, but don't be don't be disrespectful all the time. You know, I understand that that anger and you feel it in your in your heart that you just wanna uh, you know, it's like you know, you know, you, you, you just want to drop the world for everything what's really going on. And I understand, man, just hold on, man, because we'll, things get better. I know I went through a lot of stuff, man, and my dream for passion, the music I'm trying to make, but I got to do other things right now because it's, it's very difficult right now because a lot of that, there's people right now that's unhealthy or unhealthy. And, you know, and I bet you a lot of folks out there feel the same way that I'm talking about right, right now, man. You know, you, you feel like you, you I, I don't feel like I don't have to pin nobody because, you know, I don't feel like I don't need nobody. You know what I'm saying? It's hard to people, get people that you need sometimes because you feel like nobody cares. We need to show a lot of that we care. If no one cared, then we all care. We all failed. We all failed or not to proceed, man. Like I said, man, because we got so much hatred in our heart, and we just want to take on everything, take on all that. And I'm not saying violence or the answer. Violence is not the answer. Sometimes you just have, you can be a hero and save everything would be saved, but sometimes you got to walk away. Leave things unsaid or left alone because of you, because it will come back on you. And I think that's what it takes to be a man. But we need to teach these kind of boys that we see right now, especially when we being a father and showing them because you got women right now. That's why women have a hard time respect men too. Just like men have a hard time respect women because women right now, they ain't grow up without a father. They ain't grow up without a dad. That's why they, they so confused sometimes that they don't know who, the, who being a real man is and all that because they want this bad boy persona. A lot of them don't know bad boys got, you know, emotion too, just like good boys do. And they both are not weak. A lot of people think good boys are weak. Good boys ain't weak either. I don't know what they get this stuff from because they think they're they so nice. I used to be real nice, but I can't be nice because I could be a real mean son of a bitch. I can't be that. Excuse my language again. I can be a mean son of a gun, you know, but it's like that, man. To everybody, younger man, young man, older man, stay up, man, because I think that's what real takes a real, real man is. As long as we stand a nation and we stand in one nation and and other world, and we can rule all rule, you know what that means. So that's what it takes to be a man is take a stand and, and, and stand everything what you stand for. All right, all right. It's your boy Domination YouTube. And that's all I gotta say is back at the basic. Chuck Reduce, that's all we do, Texas, baby. Alright, alright. Peace.